Woman FC TV with Aaron FC following a 3 1 defeat to Chippenham Town. Aaron, what were your thoughts on the game? Uh, I think I think this was the one game where I think we were not quite at it in terms of quality uh, on the ball. Um, I think the last two games have been really good. I generally do. I think we've got into some really good positions um, and we've played some really good staff. Obviously, haven't had that bit of luck. Obviously, last game, forward works. Um, offside goal is pretty much offside. But today's game was. Yeah, I think we just lacked the quality today. Yeah, the topic was specifically was lacking today. We didn't seem to have quite the same kind of game just maybe on Tuesday night. Yeah, I just think, I think in terms of like the circumstances, obviously the pitch, quite narrow, quite bobbly, I don't want to make excuses, but I think that obviously does impact on one, how many chances you can create, and secondly, when you do get those chances, it does impact the quality. I think I just think we that's what we lacked. It was a game where we were never going to get loads of chances like we have done in the last two games. So it's really important when we did get the chances, we just were clinical. And just today we weren't that, we weren't that clinical. What do you think going, it's another game where we weren't conceding three, which I mean, for a defender as yourself, that is a pretty disheartening thing. What do you think is going on at the back at the moment? Uh, I think the last couple of games prior to this one, we've had a few sort of individual errors. Um, set plays is a big thing. Set plays is something we're going to look at um, in terms of how we set up going forward. Um, but yeah, I think, I think, like I said, I think we've had a few individual errors. Hold the hands up. Okay, that happens in football. Obviously, it's the way you move forward. Um, but set plays is a big thing we're going to look at. Personnel-wise, on the pitch, Brad Dolligan gets a first start today. How do you think he got on? Yeah, done okay. It probably wasn't maybe the right game for him in terms of obviously he showed some really good quality on Tuesday night. Um, and this tonight wasn't quite the game that maybe suits his sort of style. But on top of that, I thought he did do well. He had some nice stuff, he had some good movement, um, he worked hard at the uh, defensively, which is what we asked of him. Um, so yeah, he was, he was good. And uh, Nick Wheeler as well getting some minutes again after a long stretch uh, off the pitch as well, and you see his delivery, I mean, that's something that really is missed. Yeah, I think so. I think, um, yeah, we want to try and get that sort of more quality on the pitch in terms of in the final third. So bringing him at half time made sense. Uh, and like you just said, he's done some great balls in the box today. Um, so hopefully he recovers well. and be sort of fit to carry on and go forward. Are you looking forward to having a week with no games coming in? We've got two training sessions going into next Sunday now into Bath. Is it good to have a fresh set, not another game interrupting that? Yeah, I think so. I think when we look at the last two games that we've played, or three including today, um, we changed formation halfway through Taunton. And then since that game, we've only had really um, a session to work on it. So it'll be important now to sort of apply that and work on that over these next few uh, training sessions. I think that's um, that's been one of our, or something that's held us back a little bit in terms of we haven't had time to work on um, certain parts of the shape that we've implemented. So I think it'll be important this week to get those sessions in.